the roads a lot of the traffic with this road is this carol concert or whatever i have tell that just recently opened the usual um firm spirit uh, for christmas Hi my loves and welcome to another vlog in the kitchen. So how are you guys doing? How are you guys faring? Today is the beginning of a vlog, I would think. It's a Monday and we're starting up this vlog slowly winding down into the Christmas. Hey, hey, hey. Hope you guys enjoyed all the vlogs that I've been dishing out um this december like i'm being very very intentional about putting out good content and um a lot of content this december period and i'm hell-bent on doing that but for now let's toast some bread and um, for papa and for me so papa is having toast bread with sardine tomatoes onions and some avocado um pear in it but i'm having just sardines and avocados because i don't do no onions <laughs> so he's gonna have that with tea and i'm gonna have that with water because i don't do tea and i'm not about any fresh juice this morning and then i had to work see at this point i don't know how people work in december but i need to tell my boss that my brain is no longer in the office my brain is just for jollification enjoyment you know all those kind of things i'm i'm not in the mood to draft any brief of argument any brief or whatever it is i just want to jollificate i'm gonna answer woman and tell woman i be woman why i did not get married this year and give them my explanation so until then let me just shower and i'll see you guys when i'm off to work obviously bye Let's do the dishes and get out of here in quick time before they sack us. Let's go to work. I don't even feel like going to work, but I've got to go. So I need to make money, so I got to go. So I'll see you guys later. Let me just head in. I'm already late. But you know that kind of lateness where you know you're late, but you just born. So nobody will talk to you. Hey. That's the time I'm going to give right now. <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys later. Telling me not to come to work today, but I refused. And just we got wind of the fact that um, we got knowledge of the fact that the INEC office in Nemo State was burned down last night by some people. So today's a Monday, so a lot of people are scared of coming out. Even some of my colleagues didn't even come to work. I don't even know why. I, I just came to work. I, I don't know. Like It was just impossible for me to leave after I had come to work. To get to be like, oh, you're already here already. So I can't just wait. But yeah, I'm done from work and I'm going home now. So I also straight got to the eight though, but I forgot that I was vlogging. So I had roasted yam and fish. It was nice and in my belly now. So what is the morning Can you tell that I'm obsessed with this boy? <laughs> All right, let's just get to work the next day because I mean, we have to work now. And welcome back again to my YouTube channel. So today is a Tuesday and I'm not in court because um, the Emo State Judiciary held their assizes today. So that's like the opening of the legal year. So no courts would sit in Oweri. So that's why I'm in the court. And I'm here in the office because I'm tired. Looking out on the morning rain. Ah, 
Yeah, so another day, another court session. Um, just here to do my matter and go. For me, I, I don't think I have any ounce of energy in my body anymore for anything litigation for the rest of the year. And I parried or something for the close of the year, with the opening of the year, because I don't even know what we're doing here. So this is what the roads in Imo State look like. Um, I tried to take out the sands from the roadside and to... It caused a lot of dust with the hammer tan here and yeah, everything was just woozy woozy. I used to feel so on fire. Oh and when I knew I had a face I wanted to show you guys the INEC office that was um burnt down a bit. So this is it. They're trying to um increase the size of the fence for now and security is also heightened there as well so let's just get to the office round up and and just hope that this office closes because how is it the 22nd i'll be 21st and i'm still working so i took a trip to the village you know man, christmas you have to go prep the house and stuff and i noticed that this is emi kuku for people that know that's big um church there so they're they're grading the road and it caused a lot of traffic and i know it will cause a lot of traffic this is the emekuku um um emekuku mbise road yeah so i don't know why they started this road project late but um better late than never i guess uh, the roads a lot of like a lot of road constructions are currently on the way a lot so a lot of traffic a lot of dust a lot of everything but we hope that in in due time everything will be sorted out so that we enjoy the benefits and dividends of democracy I want to go home. Last year, I did um, mansions in the villages, like um, in villages why Nigerians build mansions. Like people are still building, like crazily. People are still erecting stuff. Hey God, I thought all of you said there was no money. I thought we all said there's no money. So why is it that I'm seeing mansions being erected in the villages like crazy? So like I said, the traffic with this road thing here. Yeah, it was crazy like this was around past seven and it took it took some well-meaning nigerians to speak to nigerians that they have to be sensible sometimes impatience is most 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 likely the cause of half of our problems when it comes to traffic in nigeria because what is this what 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 in the name of god is this and there's some villagers blocked their road so you don't pass through there it's like came back and i went for a christmas carol concert or whatever that's called and i wore this jumpsuit and i love so much yeah i, I i'm just <sighs> entirely grateful to god another christmas without my mom but this is one christmas i love loved her to to see but in all in all it's fine i guess so i and my brother went hotel scouting right so this is a new hotel that just recently opened it's called the amber rose hotel located at musa yaradua drive right it's beautiful the customer service is amazing uh, this is not a paid ad but the people here were so warm and welcoming and i love 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 their hotel it was it was beautiful like i said it's located in um musa yaradua drive so if you're in town and you need a place to be then amber city hotels is your place and the lease hotel here is like thirty thousand yeah and it goes up from there so i think at some point i got a glimpse of their price or their rates but let me just show you what a room here looks like so this is the 30k room so this is what it actually looks like um not so spacious but quite quite classy i love it it's not like most of the hotels you find in a worry I, I like that it's 
it has this cozy feeling to it so like i said you can check it out if you want and yeah just it's, it's a lovely hotel um. The usual um, firm spirit um, for Christmas, this is what I got for Christmas, is a lot. <laughs> it's a lot, but we thank God for his messes <laughs> and provision, right? So, yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the project supervisory angle of the brand Z on demand. The purpose of this aspect of the brand is to bring you supervisory services and bring you to speed on the latest developments on your project. It doesn't even matter if the land is recently acquired, we can get you pictures and videos before you make your payments. This aspect of the brand is best suited for everyone, especially our clients who are in diaspora. We know how hard you work there and it's only fair that you get your money's worth, especially when you send them to your relatives to help you acquire properties or even build for you. Gone are the days when they rip you off your money with us, what you see is what you get. No mago mago. Now, all you need to do is give us a pointer, pay in full, and you get your videos in the next 48 hours. 